And we know just how devastating those wildfires were. Hundreds of homes were destroyed. But Coloradans really came together. You've helped us raise more than $280,000 through Denver 7 Gives to help wildfire victims. And those funds are now going to those who need them. Denver 7's Russell Haythorn in Grand County tonight. And he picks up the story from here. Our day started with a blanket delivery to Grand Lake Fire Protection District. Blankets made by a group of ladies on the Front Range, which will go in ambulances here to keep patients and kids warm. And keeping them there for children and giving them out as we have with teddy bears and things like that. At the fire station, we met some of the guys who were working the night the East Troublesome Fire blew up. Put in a lot of work that night. I think Chief said it was 53 hours straight that our guys were actually up and working. So. I'm super proud of them. When you're in that state of mind, you don't get tired. You just keep going. <laughs> this department lost a lot of hoses and other equipment in the fire. On behalf of Denver 7 and our generous viewers, we'd like to present the Grand Lake Fire Protection District and Chief St. Germain with this check for $10,000. Few words that I can actually say that thank both Channel 7 and your guys' viewers for this incredibly generous check. Tell us about them in those days that that fire was so destructive and the incredible work that they did. So those, those are actually good choice words. Um, these guys are complete Jedi Knights when it comes to any type of fire operations. They train really hard, super dedicated individuals. Our next stop was the Mountain Family Center in Granby, where they've served dozens of victims so far with clothing, a food pantry, and other items. The toy shop is certainly good for families this time of year. We have games and puzzles. Dave Lively is one of those fire victims inspired by the community response. I almost ha don't have words for it. We are telling people we lost our house, but we haven't lost our home. And this is a big part of that. Um, my home is in Grand Lake, but my community is all of Grand County. A county served by the Grand Foundation, so we wanted to support them. Megan. We'd like to present you with this check for $75,000 from Denver 7 Gives. Thank you so much. Grand Foundation Executive Director Megan Ledeen says this will certainly serve the community well. We have immediate needs, short-term needs, and long-term needs. We're going to be funding out of the wildfire fund, which this puts us over $2.6 million. So thank you so much. A day of giving thanks to you, the generous viewers of Denver 7. That was Russell Haythorn reporting, and we know these wildfire victims will still need help in the coming weeks, even months. You can still donate to Denver 7 Gives when you click on the Denver 7 Gives tab on our website under the drop-down menu, select Help Colorado Wildfire Victims.